You're watching 8 bit days a week, and I'm gonna be playing yet another Neo Geo game. One that has been uh, released later in its life. A very popular fighting game. Um, it was also released on the Dreamcast, just not on the PlayStation 1, I think. It was released also on PlayStation 2. I'm not sure about the others. And yeah, this is Last Blade 2. And, um... It's kind of like Samurai Showdown, I guess. Being a um, weapons-based fighter. Wow, this guy I'm using reminds me of uh, Ruroni Kenshin's Hikoseijuro because he has a cape, I guess. <laughs> and of course, we have this technique. I suppose this is not Tite Mitsurugi. He is fast, though. So. There's another thing. And uh, Hibiki, I believe he also, she also made an appearance on Capcom vs SNK2. So... Um, and oh yeah, I think Moria, what I'm using right now, is in Neo Geo Battle Coliseum. Maybe I may be remembering wrong, but I do remember there's a Last Blade representation there. What? And um, Lee here reminds me of is it Once Upon a Time in China? Or one of those Jet Li films, I guess. I'm not sure if you're hearing the volume of the game, but yeah, there isn't even music on this one. Just some ambient sounds. Uh, river, I guess. It's kind of neat. Whoa. Sometimes I wish uh, Neo Geo didn't go bankrupt back in the late, oh, was it early 2000s? Because their output was this, Garo. And what else could they have uh, come up with if they didn't go bankrupt? So eventually I think Play More tried to continue. But I suppose it's just not the same. Everything uh, everything after the bankruptcy, the first bankruptcy, just felt like kind of like more KOF, more... And even not uh, video games in general, but those uh, pachinko machines, I think. 
it's nice to see SNK alive today. Let's see if they could regain their that uh, status, that high regard that um, people have uh, given them during Neojo's heydays. I'm gonna try the other guy. Uh, receive enemies life. No. Oh yes, the Super Saiyan guy. So I'd like to call him. But nah, I'll just go with this guy. if he can really see me still. This guy is just using a like a training stick. Anticipated me there. Oh, it's pretty good. That's it for me. Um, definitely deserves to be on your storage for whatever device you have there. Um, Some people prefer this over Samurai Showdown. I I, I can't really decide. <laughs> They're both good. So might as well have them both. They may be both weapons based. Um, samurai themed games, but uh, when it comes to how they play can't be wrong on having them both. Oh man, wasted it. Uh, all right, that's it for this video. You're watching 8-Bit Days a Week. This is Last Blade 2. Please like, comment, and subscribe. Thanks for watching.